back to throw. Fields. He's got his target. That's complete. Through the middle of the field. DJ Moore. Touchdown, Chicago. DJ Moore. His second touchdown on the season. And the Bears need just three plays to go down and take the early lead. The Charles here in their opening series, they said they had certain plays scripted for certain players. Now Wilson. He'll find his tight end. It's Adam Troutman. And he's able to get to deny that completion. And he came through with a nice hit and knocked it incomplete. And I tell you what, he got it from 58. That had lots of leg behind it. That also a career-long kick for the veteran. Looks like it can step up and assert its will over the other. Off play action, Fields. And the Broncos get there and take him down. Randy Gregory from his outside line from last week when he broke the century mark in rushing and had one of his best individual efforts of the season. I would expect that there's more from him on the way after that type of a game. And I know his teammates and coaches, they feel exactly the same way. A busy first quarter. His third catch of the afternoon is a first down. This is their last time out. Trying to get back in the win column, but obviously not an easy task here in a hostile environment. Yeah, always tough to win away from home. But sometimes what you do is you use these types of games. Make sure you have a little bit of physical play when the ball gets to the receiver. Find a way to jostle it free. They caught him off guard. Force the incompletion. And he is going to have a Broncos first down as the defense. 12 yards needed to gain a first down. Throwing is Wilson. And he's wrapped up. Take it down. Back at the 25. Terrell Lewis. And they're going to drop him for a six. Goal post, Charles. We'll see if they can get a better, more sustained drive going here. Yeah, and every team that we ever talk to says the exact same thing. When you start a drive from that deep in your own territory, the goal is a minimum of at least two first down. The Broncos onto the field, ready to start their next drive. And after the field goal last time, we'll see what they can get here. At least they got points out of the last drive. Trying at six. From the shotgun, Wilson. Pass taken in by his big tight end. And he'll be taken down, but he does have first down yardage. Now Fields. Able to find the open man. That's complete. And he will have the Bears first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. That's a play that would be. Now it's Fields. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And this is going to be another first down. That's what the defense gave him. Put together a solid game to bring up second and manageable. Now they have a couple of plays to pick up. And he's in to the end zone. Touchdown, Bears. Now they'll throw it with Wilson. Looking for his running back, and he's got him. And he gets this one to midfield. From midfield now, here's Wilson. Now he'll dump it underneath to his running back complete. And they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. Another catch. Up the intensity a couple more times and get off the field before giving up any more yardage. And he comes back with one complete. And they have a first down. And they certainly want to keep him off the scoreboard here. Throwing again here, Wilson. Over the middle into traffic and that's complete. And he couldn't quite get there. Tackled down at the one. He's going to lose yardage here in a big way. Now the Broncos will use their third and final timeout. On second down, here's Wilson. As a touchdown, Broncos. Greg Dulcich from four yards out. And the Broncos will take the lead here in the final minute of the first half. That could be an important swing right there. A touchdown in the final minute of the half to take the lead. And I like the point you just made there. Could Set be an down important. started. They need a full 10 here to pick up the first down and move the chains. He's got his target. That's complete. And he'll be out of bounds right at the 40. This is what you shouldn't. And that's a smart decision to just get that one out of there. 
They'll try and run for it. Here's Williams. And he's going to have the first down yardage as he's down at about the 30-yard line. A strong eight yards will keep this drive rolling. Looks to me like maybe there's a little... They're looking to put a drive in the end zone. Oh, I agree with you totally. No one goes out on the field and says, all right, let's just settle for three except he certain takes the playoff. <laughs> the running back, because he's, he's eager to get the pass, and sometimes he doesn't act very well about whether he's going to block or leak out or whatever. And I think that they saw that, and that's why they're able to get to him on it. A nice pickup of 23 on the third down conversion. Yeah, I think you're exactly right about that. And oftentimes when you see that, that means the play call is supposed to come in his direction, and he was eager to go catch a pass. And this is going to be another first down as they'll make the tackle at the Broncos' 40 to get to the 35 if they want to keep this drive going on third down. To throw his fields. And he is caught. And he will be taken down with a big pick up there. Now Fields. And that one goes incomplete on the drop. That's one he definitely normally catches. Fourth down. Well, it's been a tough go for him. These guys have been driving down the field. But defensively, once they got their backs to the goal line, turned up the pressure, that's going to lead to a fourth down. Well played. Fields. And oh, it'll be intercepted. And the Broncos are going to get the football here as the ball will come. Herbert once more. And good vision there as he's across midfield and down to the 45 yard line. 75 yards rushing for him now on 17 carries. So signs of life in what's been a dormant offense in this second half. Here's first and 10. A play fake now, fields to throw. Looking deep here for Mooney. And this is taken in at the five. Touchdown! Jarnell Mooney, 45 yards. And the Bears have taken a fourth quarter lead. Might be seeing that one on the highlight shows tonight. The home run ball here in the fourth quarter to take the lead. There's nothing like being aggressive, preaching that to your team, and then following through. All the way through. Go ahead and throw one more up there. Why not? 10 yards after the false start. Third and 10. Throwing is Wilson. Work in the middle of the field, and he's got a man complete. And they're going to have this across midfield and inside the 45. They'll come up second and seven. They'll try a little trickery here on the end of round. And this defense not ready for that one as he'll take this down inside the 25. It'll be a pickup of 16 and a Bronco first down. Well, that play looks familiar. Now it's Wilson. And the pass is caught. Touchdown, Denver. Jerry Judy. A 20-yard touchdown. And the Broncos answer back with a touchdown of their own to take a fourth-quarter lead. So quite the comeback here. They have erased that deficit, pushed themselves out in front now here in this fourth quarter. Well, this game's kind of felt like a horse race. has in that gap. Now they've stuck ahead in front here late in the game. The finish line's not far away. They need their defense to finish this thing off. And this one's caught. And their fourth quarter, he was the finisher. A really nice run. Now an option play on second down. And he'll bring it up here to right at the 40-yard line. He has enough for the first down. Of the key. While he didn't get a first down, he did get a nice chunk of yardage. Only a nice tackle prevented it from maybe going all the way. Fields with a throw that's caught by Moore. And this is going to be another first down. This is fourth down. They snap it to Fields. He's got a man open. It's Chase Claypool. Touchdown, Bears! Chase Claypool, 29 yards. And the Bears are an extra point away from tying this game here in the final minutes. Well, the hard part's 
done. Now they just need to split the post, tie it up, but then their defense is going to have to hold up to send it to overtime. Yeah, no matter what. I know there's an inclination in it when you have momentum to go for two here. And two timeouts now. still at their disposal. First and ten here. Now this one complete downfield on the left side. Now the Bears going to call the first of their timeouts as they get the stoppage with just over a minute to go in the game. Now carry number 20 of the game. Here's Williams. And inside the 20 before he's brought down. Now the Bears going to use the second of their timeouts as they get it with under a minute to go now in the football game. They stick to the ground game on first down. It's Williams. Now the Bears will use their third and final timeout as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds left to go in the game. And that's a touchdown as they broken our tie here in the final minute of the fourth. What a finish in this one, Charles. You know, this group, they come in, they have to fight a hostile atmosphere every snap. They get the late score, they get the victory, and that flight home, it's going to be a little sweeter after this one. And Brandon, just like you, I was fired up for that last sequence. How about that? Wouldn't you have loved to have been in the huddle when they were mounting that game-winning drive? Big-time moment. No one shied away from it. They tuned out the crowd.